you can now have multiple build plates within Lychee Slicer. Yes, 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 yes. When you first load up Lychee Slicer, you're gonna notice this little icon to the top left of your build plate. If you hover over it, it says add plate. Clicking on it, well, adds a new build plate. And if we click on the objects library, you're gonna notice there's a few more things going on here. One of them is this extra little button right here where you can add in additional build plates. You can also click the trash can to delete them. There's also an eye here where you can turn on or turn off the build plates. This will hide everything uh, on the build plate or, you know, unhide it. You can also double click on the name and then you can name it. For an example, name this one orientation. And you can see in just an example, if you wanted to, you could have multiple build plates for multiple stages within the supporting process, or you can have multiple build plates just for different parts of the model. Now, there are a couple ways you can move your objects around between the different build plates. The easiest is just drag it and it will automatically snap to the build plate that you moved it into. Another way is you can right click it within the library here and go to move to, and then you can just select which, which build plate you wanna move it to. You can also right click directly on the file itself with the same move to option. I just click on it, right click, and I can move to uh, any of the different build plates as well. As you use this function or this feature, let us know what kind of UX, UI, or enhancements you'd like to see. Let us know in the comments down below or reach out to us on the Lighty Slicer Discord.